hit a baseball, when you hit the ball right here, so you've hit the ball, most baseball players let the bat go. If you watch what my forearms are doing here, there's very little, if any, forearm rotation. My arms rotate a little, but my forearms aren't twisting and crossing over. That's something you don't have to do to play golf. I didn't do that when I started. Now, what makes it so you can do that? If you have the grip correctly that we talked about, now when you come into the ball, basically your hands feel like all they're doing is they're working this way. So they come into the ball, you hit the ball, and then your hands feel like they're going this way. Now your arms are rotating, but your hands are working this way. They aren't, they aren't twisting. They don't have to twist. Now, if you buy into the backswing that you've got to get the club face like this, where the leading edge is on your swing plane, and that's where you want the club coming down, now you're going to have to have a lot of forearm rotation to catch the club up, and that's where I spent most of my career. The best part of my career when I started, I had a baseball grip. Ten fingers, it was fairly strong relative to golf, the golf industry, and I took the club back, like my baseball back, and when I took it back, the face was about like this. Now, a lot of people call that closed. Well, it really isn't shot or closed. Then I'd get up here, and now I'd come down, and I'd come down, and when I'd hit the ball, after I'd hit the ball, because I was just hitting the ball like this, then after I hit the ball, the face would work this way. So the face was turning down relative to my target line, but it was staying at a 90 degree angle to my swing arc. There wasn't a lot of this in it. Okay, so that's how I play now. That's how I played when I started when I was my best, minimal face rotation. So if your grip's right, and you let the weight of the club make your wrist hinge so you don't twist your forearms, then through the ball, basically what you're doing through the ball is I could let the club go with my right hand just like I did a baseball. And the ball's gonna go pretty straight because the momentum of the club now when it straightens my arm is gonna square the face. And because I didn't have to twist it, it's easy to control the face. So, you get your grip right where the face works right relative to your hands and wrists and we're not twisting and adding a lot of angles that you have to time through the ball, this game starts to be very, very simple to hit the ball fairly solid and fairly straight. It still takes practice, yes. Does it still go misfire? Sure it does, but it's a lot easier to do that way.